What's the pettiest reason you've rejected someone? Her toenails were so long, whenever she was nearby you could hear clicking from the ground, as if she was a dog. We went bowling, and she started saying the bowling ball was hurting her fingers. She was convinced that there were bugs inside the bowling ball biting her fingers and that was the reason for her pain. Went on a first date with someone that was out of my league. Couldn't believe my luck. On our way to dinner, everything was going fine and the conversation was flowing. She seemed really into me. Suddenly she screamed at me to stop the car, not pull over. Stop right here right now immediately in the suicide lane of a four lane major road. Just before I came to a complete stop in the middle of this busy road. She opened the passenger door and tried to jump out. If a cop saw all this it probably looked like she was escaping a kidnapping. She jumped out of the car and played frogger across two lanes of traffic. And I sat there stunned with my passenger door hanging open into traffic. A few seconds later, she came running back with something under her arm. I couldn't see what it was in the mirror. She had a huge smile on her face, and as she climbed back into the car she squealed with delight as she showed me what it was. A fucking hubcap. She said it was to commemorate our first date. And that we could share custody of it. I could have it first. That was our first and last date. Dated a guy who was colorblind. He'd argue with me about the color blue-green, even if I was the only person in the relationship who could actually see blue-green. She gave me a hug and a budger that was stuck to her nose got on my shirt, and for some reason I never recovered. It's been 10 years, and I still haven't forgotten. She laughed like butthead. My perpetually single friend has turned rejecting people into a bit of a sport. I'll tinder for her. Which is all sorts of amusing. But one day. I had actually met someone for lunch and thought here's someone that's kind of her type. I wonder if she'd be interested. I ended up pulling up his website and showing her some pictures of the guy. We get to about the sixth photo in. Of two of his cats. In a treehouse. She explains his cats look bratty. Yeah. Well. That's why you're single. Still. Six years later. She had the same name as my mom. I just couldn't. I was the one rejected. But the reason I was given was I've been rejected a lot. I want to know what it feels like to reject someone. Their best friend told me they were interested in me too. He used too many exclamation points. Dude kissed me open mouthed with relaxed lips. Not meant as a make out kiss that was a quick kiss. Just opened his mouth and smashed his face into mine then pulled back. Oh. Had same name as a horrible ex slash. Bothered me every time I said name. Not me. But a girl I hung out with in high school once dumped a boyfriend because she didn't like his socks. She's married with two kids now. Her husband's got mad sock game. Up V. My ex's name was Simone. She was studying business administration and had a horse. We broke up after she fucked another dude. I got over it and met another girl. Her name was Simone. She was studying business administration and had a horse. Nope. Not me. But my friend once rejected a girl for not liking the band tool. And she was such a nice lady too. Edit. I wake up to 9. 0, 0, 0 of you making puns that he is the tool. Really nice guy. Looked just like my dad's old high school photos. Couldn't get past it. He only talked about his stock portfolios and his Mercedes. We were both 26. We had promised to see the same movie together, and when I showed up to go see the film they had already seen it. He didn't use pillowcases. He owned them, but never actually put them on the pillows. She ate a banana sideways. Would hold it horizontally. Peel it and take bites from the side, 